Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your next 72 hour energy reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if uh, you would like to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Aquarius. Thank you Lord God for blessing the Aquarius with a clear and concise message from you. Alright, so Aquarius, we're going to start our reading with a quote. Uh, we'll, we'll try to keep this up from now on. Um, so, our quote is, like the people who like you. Just that simple, Aquarius. Um, and this comes from me, L. Um, like the people who like you. A lot of times we, we're always grasping and chasing and running after people places things that are fleeting that are running from us and we all and we have an arsenal a storeroom of things that are just there for us to choose from no chase um people who are presenting the opportunity so aquarius like the people like you um and you know who those people are all right so let's go ahead and get into your reading aquarius this is a very specific reading I want to say it's for the people who have done the work. It really is. Um, and only you know that. I don't know that. Uh, let's get into it. So, first card is memories. All right. So, Aquarius. Um, it looks like universe, spirit, God, whatever you believe in. They want you to know that, okay, you can process your memories. And you should process your memories. If your memories are leaning a little too heavy, heavily to negativity or an old way of being or existing know that um, you're at a place of coming out of that because you have end of an era so there was an era where uh, things just did not work out for you it was hard it was an uphill battle everything was toil and labor you had to work hard for it to keep it to maintain it to have it at all if you ever got it you felt like everything was slipping through the cracks you always felt as if you were without or right now you can feel like something is not coming in for you but rest assured um this is the end of an era and for a lot of you it's going to be an end of an era um in a lot of different facets whether that's love this career um, it's, it's going to happen for you in a lot of different areas in your life um, because you have sentimental feelings. You have feelings left over that are um, from old situations, old people. Um, you're in a place of, is this really happening? Can I really make this work? Um, you go back and forth into maybe negativity or negative thoughts or the swirling thoughts. You just don't know. Um, and it puts you in a place of um, really trying to process your memories. Some of you need to eat better. You need to meditate. If you're finding that you are anxious, that you're overthinking, that you're overworking yourself, uh, burning out, you need to meditate, okay? Um, because uh, a lot of you have are leaving, leaving a toxic situation. This card specifically talks about that. Leaving a toxic situation, people, place, or thing behind, it's over, it's done. Um, it no longer should plague you. It should, no longer should um, come up in your mental space. And maybe it does at times because you can't realize, you can't believe that what you're seeing, what you're feeling, that things are actually turning over for you, that it's going well, that it could go well. Um, you're seeing it and... Um, you're almost as in disbelief. You're in that place of um, that old way of being, that old way of existing, and then this new way. And it kind of scares you because you don't know if it's permanent. Is it here to stay? But the cards want you to know that um, you have come out of poverty or lack, lack mentality or lack mindset. Now, this could be in money. This could be... Um, in love it could be in all areas but you have come out of that uh, that place of not having not being abundant um, because you have done the work you have you've done the work on yourself you've done the work um, 
in terms of your own career, you are doing the work. And we have a sequence here, 37 to 38, okay? And um, yes, some, some of you have, you have really done the work here and um, you're gonna get what you've been uh, hoping for. And it may come to you all of a sudden here because you have sudden wealth, okay? And that's an 11 car. And then you have um, toil and labor, which is um, 38, which is also an 11. So it's like 11, 11. It's like some of you are walking through a portal here. You have done so much work on yourself, uh, energetically, physically. Um, some of you are working really hard and you're, you're creating that energy, um, that motivation uh, for you to actually walk through that portal and to have long-term success, wealth. There's a transference of wealth happening uh, for you, Aquarius. What that means is that a lot of times in order for one thing to uh, propel or to go up or to ascend, another thing has to go down. It's like the wheel. The wheel is turning for all of us. Sometimes we're on the, the good side of the wheel. Sometimes we're on the bad side. For you, Aquarius, now you're walking into a period where there will be a long-term stability of uh, finances, resources, health, wealth. Um, try not to engage in things that conflict with um, where you're trying to go, who you're trying to be with. This is love affairs. This is childish people or childish behaviors. This is playful banter and romance. Um, some people are trying to compete with you because they see you on the on the incline and maybe they might even be on the decline Aquarius I feel like you wouldn't even know if they were because they are not on your radar you are not competing with them but there are some people here that are competing with you Aquarius you have come to a place of maturity whether you're a man or a woman this is specific to a woman but you come to a place of maturity what that says is with the sixth card you come to a place of harmony and balance within yourself um, there was a lot of disharmony with you where things were disjointed. Your heart and your mind uh, were not aligned. Um, you did things that were contrary to what it is you say you really want. That is disharmony when everything is all, all, all over the place when you are competing, uh, when there's a war inside of you. And it looks like you have come to a place of just really accepting you, uh, what you do, how you do it. Um, and you, you've come to into your maturity um and it looks like you will have you got so many money cards lots of money coming in by your own hand by your own craft by your own will uh this is wash rinse repeat some of you have been working really hard especially with the toil and labor card um some of you this is the workaholic uh, card here with the eight of pentacles you have just been pushing and pushing because you want to see, um, you want to see turnover in your life. You want an end of a, of a specific era, a negative era to end. And maybe that is lack, that is poverty or poverty mindset. Off camera, when I was meditating for you Aquarius, I got, the writing is on the wall. I got rejoice. So Aquarius, I think some of you just need to know that you're in a place of, transference um this is the lord of wealth you know um things are turning over for you, you got the six of pentacles coming out um you're getting gifts you're getting money uh there's a balance of money going in money going out you're able to give to a uh, be charitable the power dynamic is has shifted to the place of now you have the power you aren't the beggar you aren't the receiver in, in terms of um, someone being um, benevolent or charitable you are the charitable one all because you decided to get rid of something or some way of living or some person you decided to get serious about your own life therefore you could possibly have um, this says that money is fluctuating because it's, you know it's the eight of pentacles, so it's going in that circle. It's cyclical. Uh, wash, rinse, repeat. Um, and also, it says that 
later in life you can have travel and marriage. So this is good, Aquarius. You're working to a place of getting exactly what you want. Nothing. This is not a bad reading. I think the cards just want to reinforce to you that keep your thoughts positive. Know that you're in that middle space of, of wow, this is really happening for me. I am really bringing in money. I'm really, this is the entrepreneur also. Um, this is also the, the empire, the Fortune 500 company. Some of you are going to be wealthy in that sense. Some of you, we have the sudden wealth here. Um, we have that portal opening up because you've done work. This is beautiful, Aquarius. Understand that the magic is with you. Uh, it's inside of you. Aquarius, this has been your next 72 hour energy reading. If you want to get your own reading like this one, you can, or you can go to the website and book any reading. Or if you have a question or two, you can ask by texting it to the number below. You can also um, donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to do so. Aquarius, this is a beautiful reading. There's a complete transition in your energy. Things are happening so fast for you. All because you decided to work and so focus on self-development. Uh, focus on yourself. Put all the energy and effort into yourself while helping other people. But knowing that charity starts at home and, and you are definitely protecting what you have and your energy. And it looks like you're going to get a new love. You're going to get money. You're going to get acclaim. You're going to get success. There is someone who is still watching you. Um, there are people who are uh, feeling like they missed an opportunity with you. Um, people who are still spying on you. People are still waiting for you to come back around. Um, they miss you dearly. Uh, I don't know if their intentions are pure and are good. Um, but they're definitely plotting if they should reach out to you, if they should come back to you, if you will have them, if you will um, take to their message. Some people, some of these people are asking, did you get my message? They want you to know that you're their happiness. They, they want to tell you that they're going in a new positive direction and they want you to follow or they want the relationship to go in a new positive direction. This could be family members and friends too. Um, they want to present you with an opportunity here. But again, you're going to have to question their motive. Because you may have ascended. You've grown. You've matured. You've come into a place of um, fulfillment, contentment. And um, this person still may be lower vibrational. Um, choosing uh, to stay in a place of um, overindulgence. Self-indulgence. Um, they can be manipulative. So Aquarius, this is your reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. All links are below. Thanks, Aquarius. Take care.